There's an important reason traffic changes are coming to Airport Boulevard, which, which stretches from North Lamar to 183. Four intersections along that road are among the city's top intersections for crashes. Some drivers say the road on the east side has been neglected for years. Rebecca Trejo explains the changes planned and when we can expect to see them. It's a little I-35. Leanna Burnell was born and raised in Austin Airport Boulevard, she says. Some kind of accident waiting to happen. Burnell lives near airport in MLK and says she asked for sidewalks 14 years ago. Because people walk a lot and children would probably take go to school like that. There are portions of the street with gaps in the sidewalks like this. Closing these gaps is one of the city's planned improvements. Improvements for um, all modes of travel, no matter how you choose to get around. The intersection of MLK and airport tops the city's list of intersection crash locations. 12th Street and airport comes in second. So we'll be looking at those intersections to optimize signal timing, to improve turning movements, um, hopefully just make them a lot safer and um, allow vehicles to get through them more efficiently. Plans include upgrading 22 traffic signals, changing turn lanes at several intersections, including MLK, creating a bike and walkway on both sides of the road and paving improvements. The city estimates the cost of construction to total nearly $80 million. We anticipate the bulk of construction to occur between 2021 and 2024. Brunel says she wants to see police enforcing traffic violations more often. Airport, it needs to be monitored, and we have a lot of new houses, homes, and children now. In Austin, Rebecca Trejo, KVU News. The Airport Boulevard Corridor Project is just one part of the 2016 Mobility Bond. If you're curious about the projects in your area, the city has an interactive map to track progress. We put a link to it in this story on KVU.com.